Hi, my name is Ronick Patel and I'm a board certified orthopedic surgeon specializing in knee and shoulder injuries in patients of all ages. Today I'd like to talk to you about meniscus tears. There are two broad categories of meniscus tears, acute and degenerative. Acute typ tears typically occur from some sort of trauma or a sporting injury that can be involving some sort of twisting or pivoting component. They can also occur from a direct incident such as a motor vehicle accident or falling from a height. Degenerative tears typically occur over time and may be present in the setting of early osteoarthritis. The symptoms of a meniscus tear include swelling, decreased range of motion, pain, and potentially mechanical symptoms of locking, catching, or clicking. Typically on a consultation, we'll start with a good history to see if there was an injury. We'll then do a physical examination to evaluate if there's any swelling in the joint, range of motion restrictions, and do some provocative maneuvers to see if we can elicit pain from a meniscus tear. I'll then usually get weight-bearing radiographs or x-rays to make sure that there's no significant osteoarthritis. If there's clinical concern for an acute traumatic tear, then we'll get an MRI to evaluate for that. An MRI is usually very helpful, not always 100%, but pretty accurate in determining if there is a meniscus tear. Sometimes the specifics of a meniscus tear require diagnostic arthroscopy to evaluate the exact tear pattern. If you have a meniscus tear, we're happy to consult with you and discuss your options to treat that meniscus tear. I look forward to meeting with you.